Emoto coffee shield. So what Emoto does? How how it will find out that okay these two uh, users are similar and all? So let's say uh, there are two users and it will take count of that preference which are coming as a common for both the users, user one as user two. So the part of the intersection which is common to that, it will take that intersection divide by total preferences by the users or you can say total uh, preferred item by both the users and based on that number it will find out how closely related these two items are. So if you will just uh, look at this diagram, let's say both, both the users are having the same item in the list, then what will happen? Intersection would be like you know covering all the items, divide by covering obviously all the items are same. So this would be coming as a uh, coefficient will come as a 1. So means those two users are almost similar or same. So that's what this uh, slide also uh, defined to you. So how it is calculated? Take a, uh, the intersection power means the preferences which are matching for both the users divide by total preferred items by both the users individually and then the number is called as a tenumoto coefficient. It is actually related with the log likelihood similarity also which last time if you remember uh, we have used in the case where preference values are not there. So but a log likelihood similarity is little bit related to the statistical part where you know you create your own hypothesis and let's assume you are creating you wanted to analyze some data so for that in the statistics there are certain rules before starting how you will see yes Prashant I am still on the 10 motor slides only so Prashant question was which slide I am sharing I am still having the 10 motor slides only I just uh, explaining that log like you so okay <laughs> because in the next slide I just have the matrix not the you know real sort of definition that's why I was uh, trying to explain this uh, log like you so because I need that screen so that's why okay so lo uh, in the statistics what it does uh, what we do actually we, we will create a hypothesis that okay based on the data we are thinking that uh, let's say our assumption which whatever hypothesis we are making it is not true but there would be counters also let's say let's just for an example I am discussing this thing uh, let's say we are saying that uh, about the sensex and uh, when the Indian government will change and uh, we are based on the data we are saying uh, sensex will go up so here you will have to, to prove that thing you will have to create two hypotheses one would be government will change and sensex will not change and second would be government will change and sensex will change okay so in this case the second one which I said government will change and sensex will change you will call it as a null hypothesis means whatever I am thinking I am assuming that this hypothesis is going to be true and then second counter hypothesis I will change that okay government will change but sensex can decrease because I am assuming that sensex uh, will increase. So in this scenario it will decrease so that would be my second hypothesis. So based on the data and all I will try to come up with a result that okay which hypothesis is correct. That is a statistical thing. Now how this log likelihood similarity come into picture? It is almost same with the Tenimoto thing only. It will also take care of this intersection part but definition wise it will say how unlikely it is that this two I, uh, uh, these two users are not having this intersection of the preferred items. How unlikely means it will it will just think in a opposite way. So if it is more unlikely means that uh, index would be low, that coefficient would be low. That's what it says. 